Hi, thanks for stopping by and checking out one of our videos. Real quick, you can find much more training for a low, low price at softwarevideo.com. We've been training people since 1994. We have online memberships for as low as a startup fee is 99 cents for seven days or just $14.95 per month for unlimited training and access 24-7. Or you can buy it on DVDs. You can see what our new releases are. You can find us by software title, by subject, by vendor, and up here at the top through our film strip you can go by our little characters here, graphic design illustrator and so forth. I'm going to scroll down here. Here's our memberships. Very affordable. They make great gifts. So check it out and enjoy this uh, free lesson on this uh, topic. Once you've created a joint, if you'd like to begin posing your model, simply select the Pose tool and you'll notice that you have some options here. If you'd like to rotate the arm now that we have an arm joint, you'll notice that the portions of the upper arm are now following. We're going to get into painting weights here in a moment, but for the time being, I'm going to just show you how to pose it. So first, if you notice, we have different options associated with our location of the joint and our cursor. So outside of it, we rotate. On it, rotates vertically and horizontally. Also, you can control Z, any of those manipulations. We can hit the middle mouse and scale so we can make the arm larger. Or if we're off of it, we can translate the joint. Also, if you hold control, you'll notice that instead of moving the the joint area, you'll be selecting the unweighted area and moving that as opposed to the weighted influence area. By holding the control, you can do that as well.